Thank you for watching this video. This is A and D Labs. Uh, I'm about to start up another channel called A and D Kitchen. So my girlfriend, she freaking she does keto diet. So I want to make specific things like I'm looking to make homemade bread. I've made a couple of them and kind of failed. But other than that, this video will be a part one of the two series. So I would look out for the t number two. The only thing I have to get is the multimeter. I already got the step town power converter. Uh, I just need to get a power supply that converts AC to DC so that way I don't burn up my chip. I bought the chip from Wish, which I will post the video of that. Uh, other than that, I hope you enjoy this. I will put a schematic up and thank you for watching. <laughs>
Alright, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I uh, got an update for it. So, well, not necessarily an update considering it's going to be on the same video, but yeah, regardless. Uh, so, this is what it looks like on the inside now. So, I kind of made everything look kind of fine and dandy just for, you know, my looks right now. I don't have the fans in. I had to actually pull them out because, well, my next video is going to be about building a PC from Facebook. Yeah, the fun part. But here's what it looks like. I kind of cleaned it up. This was going to be used for my step-down power supply, but I, I'm not quite as genius at what some of the stuff does, so I found out that those step-downs, they go by how much volts that this pushes out, which for that one, it only pushes out 12 volts. So to make this work, I have to get a power supply to plug into here, in which I'll probably put like over here or something, and it'll probably be like 100, 100 volts because these are these step down chips can handle from 100, 120 I think it was volts uh, down to, to zero, and I think it was like what was it five amps. Uh, yeah, so I want to actually hook this up inside, which I actually have room for it right in here. So I'm thinking maybe, because this is right now was where the hard drives were, I think that'd be a perfect spot for that. And then my multimeter, I planned on putting it right in here. So if you look further back, I got my main ports here from my power supply and that power supply was from a Dell so I want the step down converter right here and then I'm gonna have my multimeter mounted right into this I had to move some stuff around to make this work as soon as I get the fan hooked up and everything you can see that it works perfectly fine I've situated this so that way the green one was on this side and then the red one will be on this side for for my uh, step down converter I will put the I put the diagram online I'll probably put it in the video or I'll put it on the I'll put it on the video uh, other than that that's pretty much what I'm done with it I've had it, I had both fans working, but unfortunately I had to do, I'm doing the video on the computer, so that's pretty much all I have on that. As soon as I get it all running, I will do my second video and I'll show you how all of it's working and how well it all works. Thank you.